Hello, my name is Patrick Jamison, and today we're gonna to install our assembled mainframe. We're gonna set the panels and attach our sill riser adapter. After dry fitting your mainframe, apply a bead of sealant around the inside perimeter of your opening. Now we're setting the frame into the opening. Once the frame is square, level, true, and plumb, drill the block through the pre-punched holes of the mainframe. Using your masonry fasteners, attach the frame to the block and use shims when needed to support the frame at every fastener location. When anchoring your track, drill through the pre-punched holes and get all that concrete dust out. Fill the cavity with sealant, run your fastener through the tube of sealant and anchor your track down. After inspection, top off the head of each fastener with sealant. Using your rubber mallet and a block, snap down your sill covers onto the track. Follow the same process when snapping down your other track cover. Now it's time to install our sill riser adapter. First, apply a bead of sealant on the seam where the jam and the track meets as well as along the leg across the bottom track. Once the sealant's applied, set your sill riser adapter onto the track and use your block and mallet to snap it down. And now it's time to unpackage the panels and set them into the frame. In order to set the panel, you must insert the top of the panel into the head first and then swing the bottom onto the track. Now it's time to unpackage the second panel. We're gonna follow the same steps installing the second panel into the frame. After installation, apply a bead of sealant to the exterior perimeter of the mainframe. To recap, I've now installed the mainframe, set the panels, and attached the sill riser adapter. In the next video, I'm gonna attach the handles and make all necessary adjustments to the door.